Okay, Lynn, let's go. We got to do the intro. We got to make oh a new my one. God. Why? You... All right, Kay, let's go, Kay. Why? No. Get through the dog. Rosie, get out of the way. I'm trying to get everybody. Tripping over you in the aisle. Ian, let's go. We got to do the new intro. Come on, man. Get off your phone. At least you're not sleeping. Let's go. <laughs> There's Rosie again, right by the steps. Rosie, you're in the way. We're trying to get the intro ready. Lorna, let's go. It's time to get the intro. Uh, Come on. Let's go. Come on, lady. No. Come on. No. Hey, lady, it's time to make an intro. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Welcome oh, to the oh, podcast. Oh, <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I brought in what I thought was going to be a luck box. Is. I shouldn't have told her what the penalty was. She's into this box battle. She wants us all to lose. She ain't yeah. rooting for CCF. She ain't rooting for Trent from So Blood. She ain't even rooting for me. She wants everybody to lose. She wants us to tie. I want to see you all in dresses. She wants a three-way battle. Well, in this box battle, what's going to happen, we bought a Chalice exclusive box battle. We got Chalice. I opened it all up to make sure it's here. Other than that, all here. We got a six pops. Six. We got boxception. Box inside a box. Inside of a box. Inside, inside of a box. Inside a box. So what we got, we got six pops in here. We're going to pull them out. We're going to see who ends up with the highest PPG. The loser has to go pop hunting in their wife's clothes. So here we go. We're going to see how we do. We're going to pull this out and do our box battle. I want to see you all in dresses. So, so Kay, are you lose. pulling them all out, or do I get to pull any out? You get to pull some out. Okay. Oh, I hope you all lose, though. I already opened the boxes here. It's okay. okay. Reach in and pull one out and tell me what we get. Okay. Can you get one? I'll try. They are in I got hawks. Hawks, a flock talks. We have one of these already. It's a flock talks. It's actually the international instead of the Chalix exclusive. We'll spin it up and I'll have the PPG right there for you as we spin them up. Flocked Hawks, if you're into My Hero Academia. Really cool pop. Definitely something that's neat. I would have had to have it for my collection if I didn't already have it. <laughs> Flocked Hawks. Pretty cool pop. Let me know what you guys think. Like I said, see it's the feather, it's the sword. That's what's flocked. All right, Kay, are we grabbing another yeah. one? You know right, who it this is? This one is Formal Levi. Formal Levi, a GameStop exclusive with an exclusive. So far, yeah. two exclusives. You were not guaranteed exclusives out of this. So Formal Levi with a GameStop exclusive. Formal Levi. Pretty cool little pop here. Um, lots of little different reasons. We got any Attack on Titan fans out there? Not a bad anime. Pretty fun to watch. Um, I was up to date. I hope in the new. I got to get to see the next season that come out. Formal Levi. All right, Kate, dig in. What do we Captain got? Captain Hook. Captain Hook Funko Shop exclusive. It is. One of the ones from the Villains Train. I know your mom doesn't have him. I think she only has those two. But I know my wife doesn't have it. She does now. So, hey, we've done pretty good. We got one for the collection. Captain. Here we go. Captain Hook. Pretty cool one. He's from the Villains Train set. My wife already has. Well, she doesn't have him. She has the one she wanted, the Evil Queen and Maleficent. Now she's got Captain Hook. Pretty cool little one for the villains. Uh, Captain Hook. All right, here we go. Here we go. Guillaume. Oh, Guillaume. Just a common, not even the chase. Oh, that could have been offsetting. Could have been awesome. Do you have Guillaume? You do. You oh. even have the chase. Oh. Do I? She has so many pops, she doesn't even know if she has. Tiome from Demon Slayer. Right here is proof that you know Miss K is spoiled. She didn't even know she had him, let alone that she had the chase. She's like, oh, I have him, Dad? 
I didn't have him, Miss Spoiled K. Doesn't even know what pop she has. I think she's got one or five. Pretty cool pop. Again, some really cool pops. Nice getting ones that I don't have, though. They're better. Yome! All right. What are we doing now? This Ooh. one is Goofy. Goofy Entertainment Earth Glow in the Dark. I wanted this one. I just didn't buy it. It kind of held off. Guess it worked out. Goofy Glow in the Dark Entertainment Earth. Let's check out that glow. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Goofy. Goofy is a skeleton. We'll have to check this out to glow here in a second. We're definitely going to see how we glow. So we'll bring him back around. Then we'll shut off the lights and watch him glow. To the extreme, he walks the mic like a bang. Go to the stage, it's junk like a can. Go dance. Goofy's crushing your brain. Here you go, Goofy. I feel like they missed something here, like the eyes and the skeleton and the pumpkin. I mean, the glow's really cool, but it could have been better if they'd had that pumpkin and then the eyes. I don't know why Funko doesn't want to do eyes when they do the glows. They do with some things. But not with other goofy glow in the dark. I said you could. Last one. Yeah, that one's for you. That I said you me. could take out one. I could take out one? Yeah, I said you Bam. could. Bam. It's an international Sam. I uh, think that this is a Spirit Halloween exclusive. International Sam. Sam from Trick or Treat. Not as cool as a Reef Custom one, but still a pretty cool pop. You don't have a Sam, you know. Reef uh, made one of these for T-Roy. I think he made it glow in certain areas, but I know he flocked part of it. That made it really, really cool. But it's Sam from Trick or Treat. Oh. All right. If there's anything in the editing of this, we're going to change it, and I'll have it right here for the value. But as of right now, with a quick total, I did because I haven't went through all these yet because we're filming it. We have $107, which isn't bad. I can't remember if this was $93 or $98 mystery box. So we definitely got overvalued. She's making funny faces at Mason instead of paying attention to the video. Yeah. So, $107. Good luck, CCF. Good luck, Mr. Trent. All right, I think I reeled her back in. She was yeah. paying attention to Mr. Misan over there. They want to pay attention to the video. We got $107. Good luck, Mr. Bradley. Good luck, Mr. Trent. We'll see who's uh, dressing as their uh, wife. <laughs> I really hope you all lose. She wants me to wear the dress. Her mom wants her to be to wear the dress. But my wife doesn't wear dresses that often. I think I should be able to wear jeans and a t-shirt because no, uh, that's what she wears. You should wear a dress shirt. I'll wear one of her dress shirts with jeans. You should wear a dress <laughs> with a skirt. Mom doesn't wear those that often. Yes, she should. But anyways, you ladies should. and gentlemen, go check out Mr. CCF and go check out so blessed pops and let's see who wins this battle if you're new here go ahead and subscribe after you subscribe right there where you subscribe it's called the notification bell let you know put a video out or a short almost every single day hey Kay, what should they have done by now um subscribe i just said subscribe liked hit the like button share share nfo is going to be on this channel this week so make sure to check us out and how do we end every video Kay? peace have a blessed beautiful day peace